Yeah, hi Steve. <laughs> well, here we are in um, in our workshop. Yeah. In Oxford. Yeah. The birthplace of the mini. Yeah, it isn't fantastic, but here's a mini conversion that we can actually tell everybody all about. <laughs> Obviously, not the only one we've done, but yes, we can actually talk about this one. Yeah. Yeah, and it's and it's beautiful. Oh, it's very beautiful. Um, I spent yesterday morning driving around our beautiful city of Oxford in Rosie. Um, which is a lot of fun and great weather. Uh, so you see some of those shots on the, uh, on the video. Uh, we developed this car for small car, big city, uh, who are based in London. And just before Christmas, we spent a really fun day driving around London. Too, oh, it was brilliant. Yeah, we, and so quiet. Yeah. It was great. You got shops where there's nobody there. It's, you know, St Paul's Cathedral, empty. It was fantastic, wasn't it? Yeah. Great, great day out, great day out. And it, obviously, she performed like she did a beauty. Yeah, yeah, absolutely lovely. Beautiful Rosie, performed fantastically, never missed a beat, just brilliant. Yeah. How it should be. How it should be. That's what we do. So, um, technically, should we look under the bonnet? We can have a look under the bonnet if you like, yeah, sure. Look at that. So, what's under the bonnet of this is a Hyper 9 and a modern 5 gear B gearbox. On top of the motor, you've got the, we've got a couple of batteries, um, motor controller at the it's back. Now, we've built them like this before, and they are really fast. But this one has a very specific purpose, and the purpose for this is to take tourists around London um, with the full approvals from TFL. And so this one has been mapped to mimic the original mini engine. And the yeah. cool thing about this is it's designed so that it has plenty of range for taking tourists around London all day, but it still has full boot and a gold bar in the back. In fact, it's got two gold bars. Now, Steve, shall we um, have a little look inside? Yeah, sure. So, uh, there you go. Yeah, beautiful walnut dash. Yeah, nice steering wheel. It does look lovely. And, yeah. the, uh, and you know, it still looks like a Mini. You've got the fuel gauge um, showing you the battery charge. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I forgot that. That's, that's, quite, that's nice, that, isn't it? So, um, yeah, so there you go. That's the inside of the Mini. One thing I forgot to ask you about. Yeah? You can tell me. You can tell the, the world, actually. Charging. Ah, charging. Yeah. That's easy. That's over here. Right. And it's beautiful and shiny. And <laughs> very simple fixture. It's just a tight Just like charger. me, really? Yeah. Beautiful and shiny. Exactly. Just take it off. Um, it's a standard Type 2 charger. Charges up at all your know, normal charge points. I mean, that's really... Nice, isn't it? Uh, it's great when, when, you, when somebody sees a, a charge lead come out of there. Yeah. They, they suddenly go, what? It's yeah. like, you always see a double take, don't you? I really yeah, like absolutely. that when they do that. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. nice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Steve, tell me what it is you like about this car. Well, funnily enough, one of the things I really like about it is the bespoke knob on the gear selector, but we're not going to have a gear selector on the next Mini we're doing, are we? We're well, certainly not, no, because the next one we have, we're gonna be a, it's going to be a direct drive, single speed reduction box. Yeah, so one of the things we've been doing over the last few months is developing and manufacturing um, a bespoke direct drive system for a Mini. It's got uh, integral diff, of course, and balance. Equal length drive shafts. Yeah, equal length drive shafts, so that there's Stops. no, no yeah. torque steer. And, um, Stops the torque steer, yeah. yeah well, that's right. It certainly helps anyway, yeah. And uh, it'll be a great addition to the range, so mm. uh, you can have the gears or you can not have the gears, depending on how you want to drive your Mini. Yeah, exactly, yeah. And, and, you know, and both are equally as, as good as each other, aren't they? Yeah. It just depends what you, exactly what you fancy. Absolutely, yeah. And, you know, when, when we went to Bista with the lads, you know, uh, they drove it around, they, they really enjoyed changing gears. They did, and, and because we needed to set it up for, um, to mimic the original engine for um, London Transport, mm. uh, having people who have been driving, doing nothing other than drive minis for the last 10 years, um, knowing exactly all the quirks, exactly everything, was really invaluable. To oh, absolutely. It really helps us with the development, didn't it? You know, yeah. we get it all right. And, and now, we, you know, we turn it into, I think, a pretty much perfect car. Yeah. 